You, you know what I always say, right? What do you say, Odi? Tell me. If you're facing the better player, you have to track him. Alright, well, at least let's see if Serdia can do that in this game. Because we have here in game number two between these two players, spawning in the top left, it is none other than mouse control, Serdiuk. And in the bottom, it is Knights Gaming, Rain Man. Currently up 1 0. And well, this is best of three, of course, in the round of 64 of the Dutch StarCraft League. And. Rayman was just, I mean, in full control of that uh, of that last game. I can't tell it any other way, OD. <laughs> okay, no, I, I even can't uh, describe it with other words. But let's <laughs> see what um, what's going to happen in this game. I'm really curious. Any, any, everything looks quite normal right now. And um, well, the last game we saw Rayman opening with a 14 pool. Let's see if he chooses for that tactics again. Yeah, and I'm especially like interested in what Surya is going to do because he has to respond in some way. He went for a, a macro-oriented play and followed it up with the Stargate in the last game. So, I mean, it, it basically meant that he ceded the control of the game um, to Rainman and Rainman just took it, expanded everywhere and there was nothing that Surya could do. So I I'm wondering if he's going to be m uh, more aggressive or have, have some kind of uh, timing in mind that uh, that really will force Rainman off the build because, uh, well, we see what he can do if left alone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but that's most times with these Grandmasters. Don't leave them alone, especially not when they are Zerg. Because a lonesome Zerg is a happy Zerg, they say. Definitely. And, um, well, I mean, one difference is that uh, Surgic is not going to try and uh, get into the face of Rayman right now. He has not tried to prevent the expansion from going down. He hasn't tried to uh, do any of that shenaniganry that we saw last game. But actually having a fast gas and, well, of course, gateway opening into Cybercore. So, no quick expansion here. And, um, well, Rayman's going to find out with the slow overlord. But yes, definitely that's a different game than, than, than last. Yeah, well, I like the play, I like the variation right here. Raymond now finds out there's no expansion, so he will be on his guard. Yeah, let, let's see his response. Actually, he's getting his own gas up quite soon, so he, he sniffed out that there wasn't uh, going to be an expansion. So you can get the, the faster speed, get the queen up, and... Um, well, you don't need gas for that, but... In any case, it, it looks um, like he's going to remain on two bases just a, a little bit longer than last game. Alright, so actually a stream of pylons being set down and... Oh dear, OD, you call it. And I think you're muted because I see you laugh. Yes, I like the play. <laughs> <laughs> This is, yeah, this is going to be an all-out push here from Surdiuk. Who's saying, well, alright, no long games against this master player, and who can blame him? Yeah, it will be now or never, we will know in a few minutes. But Rain Man will be prepared for this. He's getting speed, and when speed finishes with the, with the right amount of links, the pressure is over. Uh, and Rayman actually scouted uh, one of the pylons going down. Of course, there is more where that came from. But, uh, well, this push, it will hit in about a minute, minute and a half. Spine crawlers going down and he will need them, that's for sure. Oh, and, uh, wow. There's no second gas, though, so uh, there won't be a lot of, uh, of sentries in this push. Maybe a few less stalkers as well, but um, a huge number of zealots. That's well. what I'm expecting. Yeah, both players are fighting the clock right here. Rayman is getting too prepared Ooh. for this defense and Zeljuk is preparing the attack. Yeah, it's a very important snipe there on that probe. I mean, the pylon is close enough, but he would have liked to warp one in right here. Mm -hmm. And look at the uh, timing on those spine crawlers oh, done wow. just in time. It's now 6.30 minute mark. Well, that's one more round of warping in, and he must go right now. Oh, look at the number of Zerglings in here. 
Oh boy, oh make boy. It? Actually, there's no production here for Sergio right now. He stopped pro production, of course, because he wants to maximize this push. This is his one and final try. Yes, and Speed has just finished, so will Sadajuk have enough power to uh, kill Raymond right here? It's going to be hard, but he is a tough player to beat anyway. Yeah. Two, so let's see what's going to happen. Two, three more spine crawlers going down, and an incredible surround there. The links running by, but look at the number of zealots here. That's really dangerous for those uh, for those links. Don't want to die right away, but there is the push and the engagement, and actually the links come in at exactly the right angle. The spine crawlers are moving everywhere and yes there is a a run by with links a run by and all the links actually here being cleaned up but still the spine crawlers are there and now the links are in the base and they will soon well now attacking the gateways yeah, go attack probes. And everything action everywhere right here these guys are testing each other multi multitasks right here who has got the longest breath and we see the zerg links in the probe line and there's the g of sadayuk quite unfortunately he is defeated